During my time in practice, I've been asked many questions about wearing glasses and contacts. Like, if my contact lens gets lost behind my eye, can it go into my brain? I'm Dr. John Isgrig. I'm an optometrist with Eye Surgeons Associates. These are some of my top five favorite myths. When I started wearing my contacts, it slowed down my prescription. Well, this assumption stems from the fact that a majority of young people start wearing contact lenses in their early to late teens, a time period when changes in a glasses prescription for most people is slowing down anyways. Wearing contacts or not wearing contacts likely had no influence on this. When I get into my 40s and I start to need reading glasses, can I do exercises to improve my near vision back to where it was? Well, unfortunately, this is not correct. Uh, typically, people need glasses to help with their near vision in their reading in their 40s and beyond. It actually has nothing to do with the eye muscles. The issue is the lens in the eye that changes due to aging. The lens becomes more rigid with time, unable to change shape to focus for the near vision. So reading glasses or bifocals sharpen and magnify the near work for us. Unfortunately, it tends to worsen as we age. So we need reading correction more often with stronger prescriptions over time. There's currently no accepted method to stop this process or reverse it. So can I sleep in my contacts? Uh, nope, wrong again. Sleeping in any contact lens, whether an advertisement or an eye doctor says it's okay, it's not okay. Some contact lens brands claim you can sleep in lenses for up to 30 days and nights. Sleeping in contact lenses greatly increases your chances of getting an eye infection known as a corneal ulcer. This is sometimes a very serious, potentially blinding issue. You may not ever be able to wear contacts again. I've seen it happen and it is well known that sleeping in contacts is a dangerous behavior. It's like bull riding. You can do it, it's just not recommended. It is not a safe thing to do. You may get by and stay injury free for some time, but odds are eventually the bull will get you. I'm afraid wearing contact lenses, they could get lost behind my eye and go into my brain. This cannot happen. Fortunately, there is a wall of tissue called Tenon's capsule, which envelops the eye and forms a barrier between the eyelid and the eyeball. So not to worry. If you feel your contact lens is somewhere in your eye, but you can't see it, it is likely trapped under the lid somewhere, but it will not find its way back behind your eyeball. See your eye doctor, they can help you safely remove it. Will wearing my glasses, will they make me dependent on them or will they make my eyes worse? Many people believe that they become dependent on their glasses when they started wearing them. This does not actually occur. The eye does not undergo a physiological long-term change because you put a lens in front of it or not. You just think you are dependent on the glasses because you see so much better with them. The only exception would be if someone is using a prism, then they can adapt and become dependent on them, but otherwise it does not happen. Ask your doctor your eye questions and watch FYI to expand your knowledge.